The Santa Ana winds are at it again. Just last week, powerful gusts wreaked havoc on the Southland, toppling massive trees and taking out power. Never had wind like that, never. And now, just days later, the region is bracing for more Santa Anas. It's all or nothing this winter. That's Alex Tardy, a senior meteorologist with the National Weather Service. He says this winter has been extreme. And while Santa Ana winds are normal this time of year, what's not is the lack of rain. October, November, that's our Santa Ana season. But that's truly our wildfire and Santa Ana season. And then this time of the year, it's our Santa Ana and rain season. But when you don't have rain, you're left with Santa Anas. Little rainfall and warm Santa Anas are notorious for causing mega fires in the fall, after the heat has dried everything out. But the winds and this dry January are quickly changing moisture levels. The longer we go into February without seeing much rain, we might again be talking about fire weather because unfortunately it looks like more Santa Ana winds will set up next week. Since we have these wind events so commonly, um, we do stay at a, a pretty high baseline staffing in San Diego County. Captain Thomas Schutz with Cal Fire San Diego says that has our fire crews on alert and ready. But certainly any fire that starts with, uh, with a good wind on it, a good wind driven fire is, is going to be a challenge for us even this time of year. That's why Tardy says it's critical we don't let our guard down, prepare our homes, and have evacuation plans even late in the winter because the Santa Anas. That are with us now and will be with us forever. Um, and we need to take them serious each time they occur, whether it's wind damage or wildfire threat, sometimes both. Kitty Alvarado, KPBS News.